All right, let's talk about comparing models. So within Navisworks, you can compare two different models and see what the difference is or the, the, uh, the, the things that are the same uh, pretty quickly. And real quick, if we talk about this, if we look at the standard, just over here, if you put standard, we can take a look at right now, I have two separate I mean, one's an RFA and one's an NWD, so they're two separate models, and I could essentially do a comparison to the two, but I can also drill down into it and then pick a specific element within that to do a comparison overall. So I'm not just, you know, stuck to just one little item per item, because you could get confused by if you select an item and then select another item, you can't select then a third item, because it's only comparing two things. But these are <coughs> both within the same model. Um, so with that said, we're just going to do one model and we're going to do the comparison real quick of like this duct and we'll come up here, which this compare button is within the home tab over here on the panel tools and then uh, on the ribbon uh, and then and you can see over here in this panel tools and then the button compare and again, let me backtrack. So if we have nothing selected the button can't be pressed so it's inactive until you select two items to compare so we press compare and now we have a little dialog box that's asking us to find the differences in and the results so first we're gonna pay attention to find the differences so if right now if we do type then essentially it should be that these two things match uh, unique IDs then they'll, they'll come up as uh, um, uh, uh, different and uh, we can do a, a number of other things like the path properties override materials override transform and the results is after it identifies this what is it going to do so is it the same you know are these things the same are these things different and if so you know hide matches then highlight results whatever it is so if we do this hide matches these should hide and then it'll also create it'll save selection sets so press OK. We'll see that those two items are now hidden and we should now have two sets. And if we come over here to the sets dialog, you'll see that uh, we have two sets created. And if you do not have the sets, if you come up to view, you can press this and then you can find sets right here. And I'll just check, uncheck it and check it all in to show you. And you should have your sets uh, right there. And that's the entire project. It shows you everything. and. Uh, if you come up here to your selection tree, again, you can find your selection tree in a number of places. Uh, on the home tab, you can find it right here, and then also in your view within the windows, uh, there's selection tree as well, uh, right here. I'm going to close that and go back to home. But um, if you have your selection tree open, you can come into it, go to your sets, and we can see that now they're, they're there. If we come to home and unhide elements and if it's not on unhide um, just check unhide all and it unhides and we can now grab these elements and this may be useful for if we're trying to identify what's the same or what's the difference then we can uh, quickly grab those things and maybe through a coordination meeting or or whatever the case may be talk about those um, so if now I do the same thing but let's with this cable tray and do a comparison uh, it should essentially since these are two different types uh, give us a different you know highlight the results so you can see yellow um, uh, in, in, in blue is so it's identifying that these two elements are not the same and then we can use this as a talking point as well and uh, these you can see here he created uh, some um, some new sets for this comparison and it removed the old ones so hopefully this helps and before I exit out you can try this on a number of different properties um, you know IDs names things like that uh, whatever you know you're trying to use it for uh, one nice thing that I've done is taking uh, two models and quickly doing a comparison to see what was different from one to the other um, uh, check it out, you know, let me know if the tool is helpful and uh, uh, comment if you can and uh, please like and share and thanks a lot for watching.